Hey everybody, welcome. It is a beautiful day. I am squinting from all the sunshine that we're seeing out here. So welcome. I'm going to give you a tour of this um, beautiful Monaco home. It's a model by Holiday Builders here in Freeport, Florida. So I'm going to go ahead and switch that around so that you can see um, the brick. Kind of get the, the front view of the home. There is the um, either like a golf cart garage or you can turn that into a media center. So there's lots of options on this. This is um, one of the uh, most popular floor plans and it's also their biggest floor plan. So um, this is a custom, or not a custom, this is a, um, a home by Holiday Builders and I do not represent Holiday Builders. I am an independent agent, but I have the privilege of sitting there model um, every once in a while out here in Windswept. So I just wanna give you a tour. If you have any questions about this home um, or any of the options, put the comments in the below, uh, down below. If I can't answer them, then I will get you in touch with um, the agent who um, works for Holiday Builders and typically sits here. So this is, um, to the left is this huge dining room. You can get the um, tray or co coffered ceilings in here. Look at these beautiful floors. And then over to the right, um, you do have the option of closing this in um, and making a hall hallway if you'd like to. Hey Morgan, how are you? I'm just giving a tour. I get to set this beautiful model home today. Um, off here, this is the door. Um, and I won't really kind of go in there. It's the, they're using it as the office right now. Um, but in there is, you can turn this into a media room or you can um, keep it as a golf cart um, storage room or for utility, you know, utility vehicles, anything else like that. So you get a feel for this great big hallway, lots of light in here. And again, the dining off to the left. And this you can leave just as they have it as an office or you can close it in. So it's not a custom home, but you can make certain changes. Um, they'll let you know there's some little things you can do and I'll show you, I'll pop that in front for a second so you can see the floor plan. Um, and some of the options you can add a sitting room or um, some other things like that so look how spacious this is i mean they have lots of furniture in here and it's not crowded at all light and bright so you've got the formal room over there and then you also have um, a little dining nook it's really not that little but it's a pretty decent sized table over there with six chairs on um, this nook back here oh he does oh okay You'll have to send me um, his info. I have some friends looking for a golf cart within the next couple months. So if he's local, Morgan, send me his information. Oh, of course, my son's trying to text me right now. <laughs> like, no, he can't call me right now. Um, all right, so this is um, the um, upgraded kitchen. So this is um, not the standard kitchen you'll get, but you can upgrade to this one if you want that gourmet kitchen with the flat top. So look at these pretty granite, nice and neutral, calming, calming. Oh, that's close enough, yeah. Okay, yes, put his uh, information in the con uh, contacts if you want to or PM it to me, however that works. All right, so we're gonna come in through here and then on the left side of the house, we're gonna kind of work our way back. What I love about this floor plan um, is, so there's the, a really pretty bathroom again double sinks lighted tile um sh tile shower believe that's an upgrade in this one but look it does have a door in here and i love that you can go outside so uh, if you're like me kids are running in and out of the house all the time it is so nice to have a door um that goes to the backyard to the back porch so they're not tracking everything through the house every time yeah i love that neutral um it's really bright um, but not quite all white so this is one of the bedrooms um this one can either be a four or five bedroom plan so they just had the cleaners in here and the carpet has that pretty pattern i'm not going to walk through there and mess that up i'm only that to somebody else 
I just need something to come kind of decorate my house and keep it clean like this, right? So that's the second bedroom. So there's two back here. So you've got plenty of room um, if you want to do guest rooms back here, offices, nice out of the way. But of course, you still have the two, the front room that could be an office. So now we're walking down the hallway. And here is another bedroom. This one I am going to step in a little bit. So this one has its own bath right here. And they've done the granite and the, um, the gray back here as well. So if you've got, so we looked at this for us. I'm like, if you have a teen, um, this would be a great kind of, you know, where they get their own privacy or a college student or a parent um, living with you. This extra room is awesome because it's so private back here. They could come in through the um, garage and come right in. So we're gonna work our way back down this hall. See the beautiful flooring, this hall. It's like your own little suite back over here. It's got this cute little bump out area off the garage. Um, you could just put big mud room kind of area here. You can't close it in because, it, well, I don't think you can close it in because of the thermostat there, but you could add a big um, you know, tree or something like that, lots of storage. Look at this laundry room. Talk about storage for days. So you've got a closet in here, and then look at all of this room. Now all of these closets um, don't come with it, or the cabinets, just so you know. Um, they added these after, but this is a huge space. It's 10, um, let me look at the long, it's 11 feet and one inch by 12 feet and one inches. So this is a huge, huge storage room. Okay. Oh, thanks, Morgan. Awesome. I will send my friend their information. Your dad's information. All right. So we're going to walk back through this way. Let's make sure nobody's coming in the door. Okay. We're all good. Okay. Now we are going to go into the master. Now this one does have the, um, the owner's suite, the owner's retreat out the back. So that adds um, about 180 or 167 square feet, I believe. Look at this. Oh, I hate stepping on the floors when they're so perfect. I'll try to be neat. Look how huge this is. This is your own master suite. Oh, they did turn the lights off in here. Let's get the lights back on. There we go. All right. I know, isn't that laundry room amazing? And so here is the master bath. Again, hey Sam. I believe the tile uh, in the shower, that's an upgrade. Otherwise, it'll probably just have that um, insert in here. There's a shower back here. I mean, a closet back here. Caught myself on the camera. Double sinks, so you've got one here. And then all the way down there, you have the other one. So lots of room for everyone. Look at the master closet. Oh yeah. That is huge. Let's see if it has the dimensions on here. It doesn't on here. Okay, I was gonna give you the dimensions, but it is large. And then there's another closet even in here. So between that laundry room and this, Sam, how's it going? And then of course your toilet's in there. And then, ah, uh, thanks. Yeah, this is um, one of the ones. So um, my husband works for Holiday Builders. This is not the model he usually sits at, but um, I got to sit here today and kind of showcase this home for the next couple of days. So, and again, you can get the tray ceilings in here, light, light and bright, and it is so big. So the master's um, suite is normally 15 um, and three inches by 18 feet and one inch. And then you add that owner's retreat and you get another over 150 more square feet. So it's gorgeous. So Windswept Estates, if you're not familiar with this community, it's a golf court com community. It has 18 holes. Um, it's rated five stars. And so I'll kind of pop out the back door here. So that's that door to the bathroom that I love. No tracking in and out. Ah, Sam, I miss your face too. Hopefully we get to see you next year. So listen to how quiet it is. It's been like this every time I've been out here. 
Um, the lots out here, they're generally at least um, 0.4 to an acre. Um, some are two and a half acres. So if you don't want that, um, if you kind of want a neighbors and you want a, a community feel, you love to golf, there's a pool here, tennis courts, basketball court, um, a little playground, um, lots of trails that go through, and of course, your golf course. Your golf cart in this model can fit right in that little um, golf cart um, garage. It's got a separate little garage out there, so it's the two-car garage plus that golf cart room, or you can make it a media. Hey, Sam. See, now I can wave to you. <laughs> Back through the kitchen, and we are going to end our tour. Oh, let me show you the pantry. So the one thing about the house I'm in now, my pantry is kind of tiny. Um, this has got a great big pantry, and plus, with that laundry room, I mean, it's ridiculous. That's storage forever. So if you want more information on this one, just comment below, send me a message. Um, I'll get you in touch with Natalie. Natalie um, is the holiday um, representative that sits this model out here in Windswept, and she is in the know about everything. So she can help you pick a lot. She can help you pick um, the different options that come with it, the different flooring, um, all the different granites, you name it. Uh, she is the gal. So anyway, thank you guys, Morgan. Thanks for that information. And uh, hopefully we get to see you guys soon. Have a great one.